YouTube released some new rules last week and everyone is losing their minds about it. Hey, howdy, hey, train wreck. How are you today? I am the glorious train wreck mom. If this is your first time here, welcome aboard train wreck. Glad to have you here. This channel is a safe space for all train wrecks, except here we don't give you a puppy and a latte. We give you sarcasm and humor. <laughs> Holy wow. First, let me preface this and let y'all know, this isn't for my moms. This isn't for my writers. This isn't even for my Disney fans. This video is going to be for my YouTube friends. Guys, why are y'all tripping? You weren't making any money to start with. Seriously, you and I both know it. The new rules that got released, they kind of suck. I'll admit it, they kind of suck. I was literally a thousand, thousand views from hitting the 10K mark. I get it. I totally do. We're not in this for the money. Are you? I mean, don't get me wrong. I see this as a way to implement a new income into my life. I see this as an opportunity to get, you know, more books sold and stuff like that. And, you know, direct people to my blog, which earns me money as well. But in the end, we all know AdSense don't make sense. Okay. Everyone sees PewDiePie. Everyone sees Markiplier. Everyone sees all these big YouTubers. I'm not going to mention he who shall not be named. Because everyone's blaming him for this. And everyone blamed PewDiePie for the first apocalypse. I get it. We all want a scapegoat. We all want someone to blame. The fact of the matter is, this was all in the works long before these two idiots walked into a forest. That's just where it's at. This was gonna happen no matter what. They wanted to make it better. Better. I mean, seriously, are we not tired of seeing all the craptastic things that are out there now? Don't you want original, fresh content being out there? And do you seriously wanna be a YouTuber or do you want to be a content creator? Because there is a difference. There is a difference. YouTubers, YouTubers are the celebrities. YouTubers are the ones everyone knows. But YouTubers are also the ones who are going out, taking other people's content and stealing from them. I'd rather be a content creator. I'd rather be the person who puts out the new things, the fresh things, the things people actually want to see. I know, right? Crazy. But that's what I want. I also have a message. I have things I want people to hear. I want people to know that they are not alone in whatever weird situation they're in. Whether it's a mom situation where her four-year-old just shoved a whole roll of toilet paper down the toilet, or whether it's an anxiety issue and you have problems ordering food at McDonald's. Whether you're a writer and you want to know, should I go traditional or should I go self-publishing? Whatever your situation is, I want you to know that you are not the only one going through that. And that's why I started this channel. I started my channel so that other people could see that whatever they're in, whatever they're dealing with, they're not the only ones. Whether it's the laundry piling up on your couch or your septic tank backing up on Christmas Day, you're not alone. And there is humor to be seen in that. And you know what? Whatever your thing is, think about it. Are you the best? Are you the brightest? Are you putting out the best you can do every time you hit that publish button? Or are you just in it to try to make that dollar? Because if you're in it just to make that dollar, I can guarantee you it shows. And I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm in a bunch of YouTube groups on Facebook. I'm in a bunch of them. And the big one that we used to see is sub for sub, sub for sub. You sub me, I'll sub you. Okay, first of all, no. No, 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 no. YouTube knows. YouTube sees that. Okay? 
Now, the other thing though, the sub for sub, the new one that they're saying is, I support all channels that support me. Stop that. Just stop that. Because you're not doing it. You know you're not going to go through everyone that's supporting you and watch at least one video off of their channel every day. Some of us have a 9 to 5. Some of us have kids. Some of us have both. Okay? Some of us have other stuff we gotta do, like sleep or take a shower. Okay? There is no way. I love and support each and every one of my 369 subscribers. But guys, I would love, absolutely love to watch one video of every one of yours. But the fact of the matter, I can't do that. Okay? Now, let's put this in perspective here. You've really got to think about it. A thousand subscribers. A thousand subscribers? That's going to get you the whole, like, sponsorship deals. That's where the money's at. Your sponsorship deals, people like wanting to work with you and, and like your brands and stuff like that. That's where it's all going to come in. That's why it's a thousand subs, guys. That's why it's a thousand. 10,000 K? 10,000 K is a great number to have. Don't get me wrong. Still shoot for that 10,000 K. And don't listen to some other jack wagon out there who's sitting there saying, you should just quit. We all know which one that is. We all know it. And that one just needs to go sit in the corner. And go think about what he said. Don't quit. You have a message. You have something to share with the whole world. That's why you started this. Don't let this whole nonsense stop you. Make it make you better. Be better. Put out better content. Share your stuff. You know, I, my daughter, God bless her heart, tried to start a YouTube channel. You know what she hated doing? Sharing it because she felt pushy. Dude, not for nothing, have you seen Facebook? It works wraps, isogenic shakes, um, all, all the makeup. Holy cow, all the makeup. You know, all that stuff. The Mon Monat hair people. I, I mean, guys, there's even an MLM business for feminine hygiene products. I could not make that up. Not even trying, okay? If they're not afraid to share their wares, you shouldn't be afraid to share yours. And do you know what your wares are? It's you. It's you. You are your product. You are your brand. So you go out there and share it. You got no problem talking about the Starbucks that you bought. You got no problem share showing off the shoes or your coat. Some of you guys are out there doing unboxing. You share people's stuff all the time. Share you. Because you are wonderful. You're out there. You're trying to make a difference. Whether it's for you or someone else, you're trying to do something. So many people are out there talking about, they wanna, they're gonna, one day. Well, guess what? You're doing it. And I don't want you to stop. I want you to keep going because you are amazing. And you're sticking through it. And you can do this. We just got to do better and bigger. And we will we will see the fruits of our rewards eventually <laughs> okay now i love you i want you to go out there i want to see great content out of all of you and it's not the end of the world and no one is getting fired i really wish to god i would stop seeing people say youtube is firing me no they're not you're an idiot i'm sorry did i tell you something you didn't know well, let me tell you again, you're an idiot. You're not being fired because you were never hired. You joined this. You started this. They said, here, we'll give you some money, but they're not firing you. They're making you work harder. That's all it is. Maybe you got complacent. Maybe you got lazy. Maybe you got comfortable. That's where it's at. Get off your butt, start doing the hard work, do it all over again if you've already done it, work harder, you can do better. The Crow said it best, try again, try harder. You can do this, we can do this. We're going to cross that finish line one day, guys. It's going to be all of us, I know it. I love yous, 
I, I have faith in all of us. I believe in all of us because I know we can do this, okay? So stop panicking. Go get a brown paper bag. Start breathing into it. <sighs> Take a breath. And realize this is not the end of the world. The sun will come up again in the morning. And we're going to keep making awesome content. And eventually it's going to be your face that's recognized. It's going to be your videos that are shared. And there's going to be people walking around buying your merch. That's where the money's at. Merch in March. I'm telling you, it's going to be a thing. He doesn't think so. But it will be. That's all I've got for you today, train wrecks. If, like I said, if this is your first time here, welcome aboard, train wreck. Don't forget to get your ticket punched by hitting that subscribe button. And while you're there, go ahead and ring that bell because I really want you to ring my bell. Ring my bell. I also would like a like, comment, and a share. Share and star for cares. This is a safe space for all train wrecks. We don't give you a puppy and a latte. We give you sarcasm and humor. My books, Platitudes of Gratitude and All Your Fault are still available in ebook and paperback on Amazon right now. I have a blog. I have a vlog. I have a podcast. I'll put the links to the blog and the podcast below because you're watching the vlog right now. That's all I've got for today, train wrecks. So, all aboard.